Hello everyone. This is a lesson on perimeter, on how we calculate perimeter and area of irregular shape. When we say irregular shape, we mean a shape like this one. When you look at this shape, is not a rectangle, is not a square, is not, it's irregular. So, when you calculate perimeter of a shape like this, perimeter is the same, you is a distance around the object. So you're gonna add all of these around the object. But the problem with this question, you see here, we don't have a value. So we need to calculate that first. And then here, we also don't have a value. So we need to calculate that. So here, this side, it's 10. So this side, it's 2. It means 2 plus what will, will be equal to 10. Because this side and that side, they're equal. So here, it's 8 centimeters. This long side is 15 centimeters. Then from there to there it's 9, so from here to here it's 6 centimeters. Now you have all the values for all the distance around. Let me put the 6 here so that it doesn't confuse with the 2. So we have all the values around the object. So we can calculate the perimeter is equals to 15 plus 10 plus 9, plus 2, plus 6, plus 8. Then we take our calculator, we add all of these values, then we find the perimeter 15, plus 10, plus 9, plus 2, plus 6, plus 8. So the perimeter around the object is 50, the unit centimeters, so it's 50 centimeters. This is how you calculate the perimeter of irregular shape. Let's look at how you calculate the area of irregular shape. Okay, when we calculate the area of the irregular shape, the area is the space that is covered by the shape. So all this space here. What you do, you, you cut it into the shapes that you know. So if I look at this one, if I cut here, I'll have two rectangles. I'll have a rectangle there and a rectangle here. So this will call it rectangle one and this one will call it rectangle two, right? This value, I'm not gonna have a 15 because this is cut to a nine and a six. So I'm not gonna have that. Okay, so I'm gonna calculate two areas, the area for the rectangle one and the area for the rectangle two and add it, add them then I'll find the total area of this shape. So area for rectangle 1 is equal to length times breadth. My length is 10, my breadth is 9, so I have 90 centimeters squared. Area of rectangle 2 length times breadth is this one. My length is 8, this is my length, and my breadth is 6, and then I have 8 times 6, 48 centimeter squared. So the total area, the area of the whole shape is 90 plus 48, which is 138 centimeter squared. So when you calculate area of the irregular shape, you just cut it to regular shapes and then add the areas. Okay, this is the end of our lesson. Thank you for watching.